Now it's time to adventure over to beautiful Italy for Ciao Alberto. This brand new short checks in on Alberto in Porto Rosso right after the events of Disney and Pixar's Luca. Now we get to hear from McKenna Harris, the director of Ciao Alberto, sharing what it was like working on this Italian dream. Take a look. I'm McKenna Harris, the director of Ciao Alberto, a new Pixar animated short. Ciao Alberto is a story that takes place after Luca, and we get to catch up with Alberto and his new life in Porto Rosso. He is having so much fun while his best friend Luca is away at school, and in particular, he's trying really hard to bond with Massimo. And since this is Alberto's story, it wouldn't be complete without a little bit of troublemaking along the way. It was so fun to make something that is entirely his and feels like we're getting Alberto's unique point of view on things. One of my favorite behind the scenes stories is that since Ciao Alberto was made entirely from home and we couldn't review things like lighting for the short in a theater, we would have to use blankets instead. And I was always so excited to get my blanket out, put it on top of my laptop, just like this. <laughs> and it felt just like a theater. I hope audiences fall even more in love with Alberto and Massimo and everyone in Puerto Rosso. And I hope that if they've ever felt like Alberto, they know that they'll never be too much trouble. Make sure to stream Ciao Alberto, a Disney Plus Day premiere on November 12th. Silencio Bruno. Ciao.